talking with your students about text and how at a loss you felt to discuss with them about how we could do what they were trying to do, which we all talked about when we first started teaching web design in our courses. We, I had no clue. You know, I had no, not one single rule of design that I could use except for don't make really loud backgrounds. That was like the only thing that I knew was bad from personal experience. Mm -hmm. And and the, 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 that I needed, I needed, no matter how hard it was, no matter how bad it was, no matter how mean people were to me, I needed to be there. And I, that I was going to stay there. If I could at all find a way to stay there, I was going to stay there until I learned some stuff that I felt like I needed to know. You know? Mm -hmm. um, so, in, for example, that whole conflict, I mean, I was very conflicted about that class. I had an incredibly high level of anxiety. But, um, it did me a lot of good. It was what do you think caused that anxiety? I mean, was it a fear of what? Of, it wasn't, of getting a bad grade it wasn't or not fear. learning? Or? It wasn't a fear. I was never afraid. I was pissed off. <laughs> <laughs> Well, no, I mean, I mean what was, what, I'm right. sure there were underlying fears, but I don't remember what they were because I was so pissed off. What was it that you were trying to get out of that class or, or achieve with that class that you, were, that you weren't achieving? Okay, here's the thing. I can tell you what happened in that class. Well, here's no, the thing. Yeah. Here, and because it is important if we're thinking about, as teachers, bringing students who aren't in our discipline in, into our class, I, I, that's what I learned the most from that. I learned more from that class about what I was going to have to do as a faculty member in my future career, in which I've already said it's one of my top five things I want to do to encourage students from other disciplines to talk with me about their work and to give them whatever I have to offer. Mm -hmm. um, you, you really have a very difficult job to do when you're working with students who are not from your discipline. That there are language issues, that there are skill issues, mm -hmm. and you really have to decide how you're going to develop your criteria for grading and responding to the work of these students. 